But the million dollar question I think uh, my clients and the audience would want to know is what is the demand and supply uh, when it comes to buying and selling of properties in uh, in many of these blocks in six stage Banashankari? What is the price presently uh, which you recommend somebody can buy today? And what is the appreciation expected over the next three to five years time? This is the same Banshaka sister you would have invested at 10 years before or 15 years before. Your once 1 lakh investment would be today's 1 CR. Hello, welcome to this uh, brand new video about Biria properties. Uh, we are today in Banashankari. Uh, my name is Balaji Badrinath and uh, I sell premium and luxury real estate with Polar Banker. And uh, today I have uh, my friend, associate uh, Satish, uh, whom uh, we exclusively work uh, in and around uh, Banashankari, Anjanapura, SMB and Kempagoda layout exclusively on Biria properties. Uh, so friends, uh, today we are here uh, to know about the complete uh, history about the Banashankari six stage developments. What we are going to cover in this video uh, is the number of blocks like you know Banashankari six stage has block 1 to 14 and uh, we are going to show you the complete uh, approach uh, inside uh, developments and the significance of uh, all these uh, blocks and as well as show you some of the uh, developments, recent developments here um, and also uh, show you some of the view of the plots and what are the uh, what are the price ranges etc etc and so many informations today we are going to cover. So are you ready? So if yes then click the subscribe now button and tap the bell icon so that I can notify you many such videos in the future. So without further ado let's get into this video. Uh, Satish. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the channel. Back. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, me and Satish yeah. have done uh, a video in the past um, exclusively on PDA e auction. If you haven't watched that video, it is somewhere here. Please click this link so that you can watch PDA e auction, how you can participate. The link is here. Uh, that's, that was our first video together, uh, Satish. So, today. Successful uh, video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Successful video. Yeah. Of course. So, <laughs> we are going to talk about that uh, in length after some time. Sure. But now. Uh, can you just elaborately discuss about uh, the history about uh, the BDA uh, developments, especially in Banashankari? See, this is uh, the acquirement has started from Karnataka early 2008 it started. Eh? In 2002, 2004, the layout has uh, you know started that uh, uh, kind of formation of the BDA started. It is we can say 15 years old layout. Eh? That uh, the entire development we have seen was from last four to five years. Now it is a uh, you can say it to development layout and it is very growing fast. And it is a kind of very close to Radhaeshwaranagara, Uttarali, and Kalikpura Road. People are, you know, very eager to purchase and build a plot here. It is, you know, uh, one side of very close to the forest area. It's called a Turali forest. One side of city you can see, and one side is the entire forest you can cover from six stage. Okay, excellent. So now, can you tell us something about the various plot measurements available? All developed the by measurements are available, like you know, starting from 2030, 600 square feet to you can get up to individual plot of 6,000 square feet of a individual plot dimension. 30, 40, 40, 30, 40, 40, 60, all the dimensions, 20, 30, 30, 40, 40, 40, 60, 50, 80, 80 by 80, uh, 50 by 120, like you know, all the dimensions, residential, commercial. Okay. So, uh, Mr. Satish, can you also tell us the price points, approximate, I know price changes keeps changing, hmm. but uh, can you tell us uh, some of the blocks, what are the price ranges, uh, uh, which has been uh, hovering around, what is the price ranges per block? Per side. The entire 14 block, the minimum minimum price starts from 5,000 rupees per square feet. It's a minimum benchmark, you can say. It is start from 5,000 rupees to 11,000 rupees as a residential property. Even go for a commercial property, which is an 80 feet road, 100 feet property, which goes for 11,000 to 15,000. Depends on the location. You can come to the first block, what you say, it's close to the Brigade Omega, or close to Kanakpala Road, KSA, Engineering College. It's all go more than 11, 15,000 rupees as a commercial property. And you come to RV College, this is the RV Architecture College where you are standing here. The residential property still goes 8,000 rupees per square feet. Commerce will go like 11 or 12,000 rupees per square feet. It is always variable, depends on uh, you know owners and the purchaser. It is not a MRP price, it's always close, like up and down, depends on their conditions. Okay, so can, can you tell us uh, which is the block which is most developed? 
and uh, why it has developed uh, so much compared to other blocks. Uh, Balasahikari 6th to stage, first block is fully developed, you can say. That is close to National Public School, Presidency School, and is close to KSA TG College, start from Kanakpara Main Road. It's very 2 kilometers from the Kanakpara Main Road. Because of the development came through Uttarali, uh, Pundar Pragna Leod, or Radhanashivanagara, the, the development is continuous to the first block, which is already fully developed area. The first block is very premium and is very costly in the entire 14 blocks. I see. So, what is what is the approximate price uh, ranges in first block? It starts around uh, 10,000 rupees per square feet and it is always very relevant. Well, it depends on the owners and their you know, uh, uh, time, like you know, one month, two month difference of the time. Got it. So, uh, as uh, you would have you know, seen now the approach, uh, how it looks like in the first block. And as we cross the first block, you get second block and third block and now we are standing in the fourth block. So, uh, uh, we will also going to talk about fifth block, sixth block and the further blocks. So, please hang around with us and if you really like the content uh, so far, uh, show your uh, affection by clicking the like button. And also, if you want to know uh, any specific uh, uh, you know, questions, please comment below, uh, we will try to answer it. In one single six days, if you are looking for today investment, like you wanted to invest now, you would have invested a few years before or 10 years before, it is a multi-fold of investment as a growth. Today you wanted to invest and you know, wait for a further year. Sir. There is a uh, fourth block is good, sixth block is nine, ten blocks are very good to invest right now. Because the first, second, third and eleven blocks are already crossed the limit. It's almost like a five digit figure, sir. So it is very good to invest in these blocks, sir. Uh, fourth block is quite developed, uh, compared to sixth, ninth and tenth block. Even today it is a very good investment because of the growth is coming from the further side of Kanakpura or Uttarali side. It is going to be very high. Okay, Satish, now that we understood uh, the history of Banshangri uh, development from BDA, when it was formed and how many blocks are there, what are the price ranges and which block has developed the most. Now, most of uh, my clients ask this only one question, that why somebody should invest in Banshangri six stage BDA properties? See, uh, why you have to invest is, first you have to invest in BDA. Why is the second part? Why you have to invest in BDA is because of a 100% secured investment. Second is a BDA is a part of Karnataka government. It's a development authority. And wherever the BDA layouts have formed, the prices are going to get very high. And the, whatever the amenities you get by BDA, it is a first class amenity sir. Like, you know, temple, school, park, uh, uh, playgrounds, and uh, uh, other civic amenities like, uh, you know, water supply, those kind of uh, amenities you will get on a first class priorities in BDA layout, sir. And you can ask why only Banshankar 6 stage it is, sir. It is a very uh, kind of uh, close to all the city limits, sir. City limits in today's date, we cannot compare to Majestic or MG Road and all. We cannot compare that distance, sir. City limit means it's close to Jainagara, close to Metro, close to all the big, big malls, close to PVR, cinemas, other uh, things like, you know, what every day it is required. And major schools are very nearby, offices are very nearby, and convenient roads are very good. And Banshega 6 stage is surrounded by complete forest, it's called a Thurali forest. It is a very limited resource of land available in Bangalore South. The only BDA layout available is Banshegri 6 stage in Bangalore South part. And it is very uh, kind of, you know, limited, limited, limited place available to invest in BDA. So Banshega 6 stage is the last resource in Bangalore South. If you can go to north side of Bangalore, you can get multiple, multiple of layouts, you know, individually developers are doing uh, those kind of you will get. But where is a limited of land is available, the appreciation will be very more. In Banshanga 6 stage, that's the major advantage you will get. And second part of what happens, Banshanga 6 stage is the only layout which connects to the nice road junction. Entire Bangalore, this is the only layout as a direct nice road approach. It is called as a Sompura junction. From here, you can connect anywhere of the Bangalore part or other part of Tumkur Road, Mysore Road, Osur Road. All those areas you can cover from Banchangar 6 stage itself. When the limited supply is available in Banchangar 6 stage, you, you have to go further. Any other layouts you have to find like a BDR, BBMP or BMRD, you have to go further 8 to 10 kilometers. So, the other layout as done by BDA is a Kempegoda layout. Eh? But if from Banshankar you have to reach to Kempegoda, you have to cross another 12 to 15 kilometers. And the price limits are very low compared to other areas. Banshankar still you can go to 5,000, 5,500, 6,000 as a very affordable price. 
This is the main entrance of Manchana Six Stage. Yeah? It's called as Sompura Junction. This is a, you mean to say this is the main uh, entry, main and, entry exit and exit for, exit for uh, Nice Road? Manchana Six Stage from, from the, the Nice Road. Road. Okay. The other side is a sixth block of one side, and one side is a seventh block. It is called. Oh, Satish, now tell me. Uh, now I understand why somebody has to invest in uh, media properties, especially in Banchen District stage. But is it really safe? Because you know, I can see a lot of vacant plots uh, uh, even today in many of the blocks. And uh, what are the schools nearby? Either the uh, hospitals are available for the needy elders, and uh, any other basic amenities. Uh, can you tell us something about uh, these developments? Yeah, Banchen District is very old. You can see it from the date of occupation. Old layout and the safety was 100% secured layout. It is not like anything happened if you build out something is gonna happen. Not those kinds of very Android. You can go, no, you can enter anyone in this layout. It's a very secured layout. You don't get a single disturbance here. Not a noisy place, not any theft happen, not any accidents are happen. Nothing like this. A very secured layout, perfectly planned by BDA. And uh, second thing, what happened if you're coming as a school, like you know, what is the school we have nearby? There are many schools are nearby which are all reputed and recognized. Like you know, one we can say NPS. Second, there is a Presidency School, and third there is RV College, and fourth there is a Rashtrakuta Vidya Kendra is nearby. And if you go or like you know a little bit outer of this uh, Banshagar Six Stage, you, you can find uh, uh, what is this? Uh, there is one more uh, Residency School sir nearby. Seven to eight schools are nearby, which are all uh, very recognized schools. Like I am giving a big big names, I can say. And if you can say hospital, like the global village is very nearby. Global hospitals are very nearby. If you come to Kanipura Road, there is a two, three big, big hospitals are there. If you come to RR Nagara, there is a uh, two, three big hospitals are there. You can say all the schools and hospitals are very, like, you know, three to four kilometers nearby on the distance. So, so can we say about 10, 15 minutes drive? A maximum 10 minutes you can drive. Okay. All, like, you know, schools, temples, parks, and hospitals, like, whatever the semi basic amenities every day needed, it is only 10 minutes away from the Banshanga Six Station. And the roads are like you can just see this. Uh, these are very well connected to Banshengar Six Stage. Like you don't feel like it's very congested. The small roads you cannot go. You can, you can feel a big traffic here. Not those kind of all. Whenever the 20 years before they have made the layout, they have done a very good layout. Every road connects to the National Highway. The Kanakpura Road National Highway connects to Banshengar Six Stage, and Mysore Road, Mysore Bangalore Highway connects to uh, connects to that Banshengar Six Stage via 10th block, and this fourth B block connects to Kanakpura Road. And that is also one nice road junction is in the Kanakpura main road. So, so I, this kind of a development, you will never see any part of the Bangalore. So, okay, Mr. Satish, thank you so much for all your uh, valuable information. I am sure the audience will appreciate uh, the kind of uh, uh, you know information uh, which you have shared today with respect to Banchagri uh, six stage development. I think we have covered all the blocks. We have shown the approach. We have shown the developments uh, in this. And we also, you also spoke about the significance of each block and why somebody has to invest in Banshangri. But the million dollar question I think uh, my clients and the audience would want to know is, what is the demand and supply uh, when it comes to buying and selling of properties in, uh, in many of these blocks in six stage Banshangri? What is the price presently uh, which you recommend somebody can buy today and what is the appreciation expected over the next three to five years time? Manchang the six stage is already, I can say, it's a fully developed layout. You cannot compare to Jainagara as you can compare Banshangri to some other layout, compared to Vishweshwaraya, Anjanapura, or any other media layout that's formed in the 2000, uh, that time of the time. It is like, you know, it is fully developed. Every amenities are already there, people are living here, people are, you know, their daily uh, office space are nearby, everything is nearby. Why only how to invest in Banshankari? Banshankari is a very high potential for a uh, immediate growth. Like you can say, you compare to uh, uh, starting from is a Banshankari second stage. Second stage approximately 20,000 plus is a square feet price. And the Banshankari sixth stage, we can say 5,000 rupees is the minimum price available here. The between seven to eight kilometer of distance, you are getting a very, very good price to buy. And appreciation, we can say, as I said earlier video, it is a minimum of 1000 to 1500 rupees per year on appreciation year. So I suggest you to just buy. Don't think of selling of any part of in Banshagar 6 stage. It is a uh, kind of you're buying a property. This is the same Banshagar 6 stage you would have invested at 10 years before or 15 years before. Your once 1 lakh investment would be today's 1 CR. So what we suggest you to plan for a buy. Selling is a different part. 
as you can visit once the Banshan Sisters, you can understand what is the growth year and what appreciation per every year you can get for year. So the supply and demand what happens, once the property is available, you have to get it, whatever the negotiation of 100 rupees plus or minus, you have to go and buy it. So you are waiting for a uh, kind of a lower price available, we can see another property, two other properties, it is not available, that kind of a, uh, you know, every day you don't get a property in here. Whenever the property you are getting in a Banshanga system, it's a good time to buy. Okay, I think uh, uh, you have got a wholesome package about the complete uh, history about Banshanga exchange, its significance, the price range and developments and whatnot uh, through this video. Uh, through Satish, our uh, you know exclusive partner uh, for all the BDA, BDA properties uh, in Bangalore. Um, we have done a video, as I said in the, in the, in the beginning of this video, that we have done uh, a video on how you can participate in BDA auction and uh, get yourself allotted a BDA property or your dream property. If you haven't watched that video, the link is here. Please watch this video. It's very transparent. You can, you can do it yourself. Please watch this video. We, uh, so many of our clients have come to our office and participated in this. We have helped them acquire BDA property through auction. And suppose if you have missed this auction, uh, but still you want to purchase a BDA property of your choice, please contact us. The numbers are flashing here. You can write an email or you can contact me or Satish directly. We have so many exclusive listings at a very reasonable price with uh, uh, direct allottees and uh, genuine properties. Uh, so what are you waiting for? Go grab your dream BDA plot today before it runs out. Thank you for watching my video. See you in my next video soon.